Well, it's getting a little late this evening, and we started the project this morning. We got some of the posts in the ground. Still got a long ways to go, but I guess it's a, it's what they call a start, and that's exactly what we got. Now, this thing is going to be about, oh, I guess 15 foot tall or something like that for the RV. And uh, enough space in there to put the boat. Yeah, that sunshine's pretty tough on video on right now, but that's what we got. This is the beginning of the, the little carport or cover that we're building for the RV and the boat and the tractor. Now, we do have some steel over here. This is what we're going to be putting up. I'll try to video it as we go along so y'all guys can see how we're doing it. You know how out there on YouTube, everybody likes to see what's going on. They want to know how you do it so they can do it. It's the same with me. I use a lot of YouTube and I look into it all the time to see if there's something I can follow. And get some advice and knowledge. Yep, we're using old galvaloom. And actually the, the size of that shop garage, carport, whatever you want to call it, is going to be 42 by 40 by, I'm assuming 15.4, 15.5, maybe a little less, just enough to get that big torque, torque, torque 325 toy hauler in it. But this is the first part of the video that we'll be posting out there for y'all to see. We did a little groundwork, we don't have the dirt in there yet, hopefully that'll be here in the morning. But uh, stay tuned and as the build progresses, and I'll try to update you with some new videos and show y'all how it's coming along. Now, we'd appreciate if y'all guys would hit the like and subscribe button. If you're new time viewers to our video channel, sign up so we can send you future videos. If you're a returning customer, we appreciate you checking out the videos and hitting the like button. And thank y'all for watching. Y'all have a good evening. Until the next video.